Okay. Me and Mad Dog, aka Trevor, are going to do the Fleeka Bank job. We take it that uh, most of you have probably seen most of this all already, so we're going to skip most of Lester's yapping. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, yes. We don't need to hear you, Lester. We know what we're doing. We are professionals. <coughs> I never speak. Only people who watch this. Right. So Trevor's going to be the driver. I'm going to be the driller. Vroom, vroom. First things first, we have to go with Lester to the bank. No, not that far. Get in, Lester. Let's go. Just go on the sidewalk. Take us to the police on Western Highway near Tumac. Word of warning: we're on the job right now, so don't let the cops okay. notice you. If now you the race, actual finale of this. We're going to try to beat all so of the elite objectives. Friends, I suppose you want to know how we're doing this. Well, funny you should ask. I think he upgraded his car since the last time we saw him. Look at it. Picking up some equipment right, and then heading back to make our plans. Yes. Not very complex at all. We're not going in. We're not hopefully going to stick. We're just sitting back and taking a look. You see, uh, I like my scores like I like my dates. Just across the street and unaware they're being watched. <laughs> That's creepy. Oh. Oh, no. Yeah, in front of you? Right, no, I, I did not. Oh, uh, it wasn't there for me. I just spawned. Kind of glitching around for me, Another but that's okay. Full of good questions. You're like a child whose parents think it's clever, or, or the IRS. Or, well, this bank's got some safety deposit boxes, and in one of those safety deposit boxes are some bonds hidden from the tax them. man that no one's going to report missing. It's all starting to uh, make sense. Security should be light. Well... Relatively light. Yes. If your daydreams are raised on the Union Depository, quite heavy if your day job is turning over liquor stores and gas stations. And the bonds in the box will be worth more than a few blah, blah, notes blah, from a till, so blah, blah, the minor escalation is worth it to keep the candle. Plus, you know, there it is. Take a look. Drink it in. I've patched into their security feed on myself. Take yeah. a look. So we're just going to look inside without going inside. No one's going to know we're even peeking inside the bank. Staff won't give a crap, <laughs> especially about the deposit boxes. Customers will probably be thinking uh, how to turn this into a screenplay. <laughs> the boxes are in the back behind the safe door. Okay, we the elite challenges for the finale of this are complete under yes, 5 minutes and 20 seconds. Nobody gets wasted, quick, and the vehicle damage is under 6%. The bonus for completing the elite challenge in this heist is fifty thousand dollars. So we'll get a bonus fifty thousand dollars just for doing that. I've written a neat little program that will do most of the work for you, but it's probably a good idea for you to familiarize yourselves with it. You in the passenger seat. I've sent it to your phone. Take it for a dry run. Keep your hands steady. Now I have to do the wormer game. I hear him yelling at you. Oh. So how's the worm game going? Uh, well, I, f I failed once. Calm the fuck down. Pay no attention to my horrible friend. Yeah, I can feel the. You guys can't see that. I can feel the uh, controller just shaking on my end. Excuse me. He's laughing and he's saying excuse me all at the same time. I don't know what you're doing. Got the circuit broke. I'm back to you. Back to our driving. Oh my gosh. I'll be over to collect it with what are you doing? Yeah. Oh no, I wasn't paying attention. Garbage oh lord. Okay, see you soon. Hey, passenger seat. Did you get into their 
Yeah, well, I hope you hope you like uh, so far. <laughs> if not, we'll we'll promise we're gonna get better. Especially me. This first heist is not too bad. It is kind of boring because all you do is you do that little worm game and then you drive around on this first setup. Now we're supposed to go to yeah, we're supposed to go to Lester's warehouse and meet up with some uh, girl, and then we're gonna get in a truck and drive back to my apartment. I'm not turning right. I am turning the steering wheel. You've crunched up the front of his car pretty good. Come out there, and if you're ever caught, just keep your mouth it. Oh my. I'm not sure, but I, I think Lester was flipping that person off. I couldn't resist. You do. And here we are at Lester's warehouse. There she is. So now we have to. No, don't hit her. I don't want to end the mission because you hit her, and we have to do this all over hit again. Hit her. Too late to hit her. I should be using my cane. Yeah, I'll just push. I can just push you over here, Lester. Let's go. Ah, sorry, Lester. Oh well. Oh God. Hurry up, Lester. We're on it. Let's go. Now it's back to the apartment. There's no timer right now. Well, we don't have the timer. We're just trying to do it. We're trying to do this as quickly as possible. So, I mean, Is it all there? you know, we're we're not trying to destroy things. And well, Trevor's trying to purposely destroy things and not pay attention, which is why the truck is slowly bopping off to the left. And now Kyle's on to talk to everybody. Say hi, Kyle. Hello. <laughs> Trevor and I are, are making a, the Fleeka job for YouTube. Do you have any advice for anybody who's played the Fleeka or has not played the Fleeka job? What? <laughs> yeah. I, I, I asked you if you had any any great advice for anybody who's not played the Fleeka job because Trevor and I are going to, we're recording this for all the people on YouTube. However, uneventful. You cannot go off roading after you rob the bank. Stay on the road. Exactly. Because if you go off roading, you end up in the pool, which is what I actually did my first time. And then uh, you, you fail. I'll be right back. All right. Hi. My garage. Go on down. Go on down. Okay, and there's the first first part of the setup. Whoa, whoa. That's the most boring part. That's the most boring part. We'll try to do the next part a little quicker, too. So hopefully that uh, doesn't just randomly sit there and be like, uh. What? No. How much money did you make? 5K. $5,000, all right. See, it doesn't show me that on my screen. So we have to let everybody know, you know, if you're not, I'm the the host of the the job right now, so I don't get paid for the setups. I only will get paid at the end during the finale. So Trevor made five thousand dollars for doing nothing but driving a car around. So that's not too bad. Fifteen JP too. So we're gonna skip this scene. We're gonna go right to the Karuma. Here we go. Damage count for the setup too. That's the highest. Just the finale. Okay. Oh, I don't like these clothes. I got shorts on her pants. I can't see. Yeah, that's, this is fine. Here we go. Okay, this part of the heist, all we have to do is drive to a 
car garage and go up to the top level shoot all the bad guys and take their car Yes, we can hear you, that's good. They're I'm going to take the quiet way. Okay, we're going we're gonna to do the quiet way. Which basically you drive up the south side of the building instead of the north side, because they're all parked on the north side at the top. And uh, at this side we can kind of snipe a few of them. Thin, thin the herd. Oops. Put my mask on. I don't want him to recognize me. I'm back. Hey, welcome back. Is this your first time doing this one, Trevor? Yeah, a little bit, a couple times, I don't know. I already healed him. Aww. Let's go! Well, that was a very weird voice message I just received from some random guy. He didn't say that he loved you, did he? No, he's like, just someone was screaming, hey, pick that F up. <laughs> <laughs> pick that? I have no idea who he was. I don't even remember playing with them. No, that's okay. I got a message the other day from one of the the people that I've played with before, and they're like, "You hate me." It's one of the little kids. I this thing's armored. They drove right into the parking garage. They don't care. We actually really don't even need to shoot. Yeah, on this part, you really don't need to shoot because the car will fix itself anyway, even though Lester yaps at you for don't damage the car, blah, blah, blah. What in the world? That car just drove right over in front of me. Oh, sorry, I killed them. screen to whoa slow down uh, on my screen that it's not loading very quickly okay I'll yay Okay, Kyle, Trevor, and I are going to try to do the elite challenges on this next part. Okay. For the finale of the Fleeka job. Luck. Yeah. Yeah, it's down like eight minutes or something. Yeah. Five minutes and.